Hey you guys, it's Glam Curl 79 and welcome back to my channel. So on Sunday, you guys, I did a um, two-strand twist because, you know, uh, Sundays are normally my wash day. So I did the two-strand twist and I kept them in Sunday, Monday. I took them down today, but I just didn't feel like wearing a twist out, but I still wanted to protect my hair. So I have been watching uh, Black is Beautiful, I Know Lee, and I forget the other girl's name, but I've been watching them uh, do their pin, uh, tuck and pin tutorials. It's basically just another protective style um, to do your hair. And I finally was able to achieve it. So I'm pretty excited about that because I want to have variety in styling my hair. So basically all I did was roll, tuck and pin with the bobby pin. So Basically, I created a pompadour type deal in the front and I just rolled, tucked, and pinned the sides and I have like a mini pompadour type thingy going on in the middle. It's not really just a strategic type of hairstyle. I just started pulling and rolling and tucking and pinning. So, this is the front. That's the side. This is the other side. And this is the back, you guys. That's the back. So it's supposed to rain um, the rest of this week. So this is how I will be styling my hair. So enough of that. The reason for this video is because I decided to do um, an HG series. And today I want to start out with my... Uh, my favorite conditioners for my co-wash and my um, HG um, deep, condi deep conditioners for my hair. So basically, you guys, an HG for me is basically a product that gives me great results each and every single time that I use it. And I definitely don't want to be without this product. So first things first, my co-wash. Um, you guys, my... Um, HG list is pretty short. When I first started out on this journey um, 14 months ago, it almost be 14 months, um, December the 4th, I was a complete product junkie. I have tried several products, so I have finally narrowed it down to my phase, and I'm so glad about that because I really want to narrow it down anyways and stop purchasing from so many different companies. So, first things first. Um... One of my HG co-washes is the Desert Essence Coconut um, Conditioner. And I've been using this from the very beginning, ever since I bit chopped. I have found out about this product from Coily Head Chick and um, a fellow YouTuber that passed away, um, Sweet Sweet Danielle. So um, I fell in love with this uh, co-wash conditioner and I have been using it ever since. So... This is my last one. I have to actually get ready to purchase some more from Vitacost. That's where I get it. And it's only like five, six bucks for um for a little container. So that's the first one. And the second one I just picked up probably about four or five months ago. And that is the Trader Joe's Tea Tree Tingle Conditioner. I absolutely love this stuff. I got this back in July when I had went down to Dallas um, to kind of check the city out. And they have a Trader Joe's there, which we don't have one here. And I heard so many great things about um, this conditioner. So I wanted to give it a try, and I have absolutely fallen in love with this conditioner. Absolutely love it. And it's, it's 16 ounces, and I think it's only like $3.99. So you cannot beat that at all. So that's it for the co-washes. Now for my deep conditioner. I only have two. One is a moisturizing um, deep conditioner, and it is the Cacao Bark by Basque. I have been using this from the very beginning of time, when I first, first big chopped, and it has never, ever failed me. One of the things that I like about this product as well is that Rashida and her team over there, they do such a great job at being consistent. I have ordered this product several times over, and it is always the same in consistency. So consistency for me goes a very long way. So I haven't used this jar yet. But it's really nice, thick and creamy. And I've already done a review on it. But I really love this stuff. Looking forward to purchasing some more um, come Black Friday. 
And my second um, HG um, DC just got on board with this one because it was a new release from Basque. It's the Vanilla, Vanilla Whiskey Reparative Hair Soak. And at first, at the beginning of my journey, I was so against using any type of protein-based um, deep conditioner. But once again, with Bass being who they are, they stole my heart with this deep conditioner. It's a light protein-based deep conditioner, but it's also very moisturizing for my hair. So I don't have to follow up with a moisturizing deep conditioner after I use this uh, protein-based DC. But as you can see, it's almost gone. So I will be getting some more of this as well um, come Black Friday. So guess what, y'all? That's it. <laughs> that is it. I have tried a lot of products. And don't get me wrong, I like other um, co-washes and I like other deep conditioners. But if I have to choose and narrow it down, that, those are my choices right there. I absolutely love them. Um, if I was stranded on an island with having to choose, you know, my fave um, co-washes or my DCs, those would definitely be it. So, um, yeah, that is it, you guys. I will be back um, hopefully later on this week to continue with my HG series. I hope everyone is doing well and that everybody is having a fantabulous week. So, until next time, if you guys have any questions or comments, leave them below. And thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.